Done? Good morning, students. Let's be to the fourth question in conversion or sale of partnership firm into limited company. So, what questions are there? Sadhna, Sunidhi, and Sreya are partners sharing profit and losses in the ratio of 5 to 3 to 2. So, we have given the ratio 5 to 3 to 2. The balance sheet of the firm as on 31st March 2018 is as follows. So, balance is given land and building, machinery, investment, bill receivable, debtors, stock and cash. Capital is given Sunanda, Sunidhi and Sreya. Creators, we have given bills payable, we have given, we have given the reserve fund. So, we have two liability, creditors and bills payable. What adjustment says that the business of the firm was taken by the new company of the redeemed private limited on the following condition. First, revalue of the asset as follows. Machinery 80,000, stock 12,000, land and building 1,60,000. Cash and investment not taken over by new firm and other assets and liability to be considered as book value. So, cash is not taken, asset is not taken by new firm. So, we will not write in this PC, purchase consideration. Cash account we are going to open and investment we sold and get the money from the outsider. But this investment not taken from the new company. The company agreed to pay 40,000 as a goodwill. Company ne extra paisa ham ko diya and that is of 40,000 as a goodwill. The company issued 20,000 equalities of 10 each to be distributed among the partners in the profit sharing ratio. So, jitna bhi PC milne wala hai, usme se out of, we are getting 20,000 equalities of 10 each. So, 20,000 into 10, kitna? 2 lakhs. 2 lakhs ka kya milega? Shares. Among the partner in the profit sharing ratio, a remaining was paid in the cash. Jitna bhi equity milne wala hai, oh kaha pe divide karna hai? Profit sharing ratio me divide karna hai. Equity share always divide on profit sharing ratio and remaining was paid in cash. Bacha hua cash me aega. Partner sold investment will be 10,000. Jo investment nahi liya tha, kisne? New firm me. That we sold in the market and we receive the investment of rupees 10,000. Prepare realized account. Partners capital account. New firm account. Cash account. In this case, we also open the equity share account. Which account? Equity share account. So, first we have to prepare the PC. Purchase consideration by giving the information. We will come to know that in this method, we have to use net asset method. Why net asset method? Why not lump sum method and payment method? Because in this case, revalue of the asset and revalue of the liability is given. So, whenever re asset, whenever re asset of liability and assets are given, we have to follow the NAM, that net asset method. Why? Because revalue of the asset and liability is given. So, let us start the solution of the by preparing first PC. Question number 4. This was asked is March. 19. Okay. So, let's we prepare the PC. Purchase consideration. This we call PC. Purchase consideration. Okay. So, So, first column is particular, second column is rupees. 
सो फर्स्ट ऑलवेज राइट एसेट टेकन ओवर जितना भी एसेट लिया बाय द न्यू कंपनी वी विल रिसीव द मनी सो फर्स्ट एसेट टेकन ओवर अभी मैं पूरा नहीं लिखता हूँ इतना ही लिखता हूँ समझ जाने का ऐसे टेकन ओवर सो फर्स्ट विल टेक द गुडविल अपने को गुडविल कितना मिला फोर्टी थाउजेंड गिवन इन एडजस्टमेंट यू टेक एक्स्ट्रा मनी एंड दैट एक्स्ट्रा मनी इज कॉल्ड फोर्टी थाउजेंड गिवन बाय द न्यू फॉर्म टू अस सेकेंड लैंड एंड बिल्डिंग लैंड एंड बिल्डिंग we have old value and we have revalue so we will take r r means revalue how much revalue is given 1 lakh 60000 revalue is given 1 lakh 60000 after that machinery see the machinery old value and revalue how much revalue is given 80000 80000 r means revalue after that debtors d for debtors debtors revalue is not given so we will take bv book value how much book value is given 15000 after debtors we have bills receivable bills receivable how much Value is given five thousand two hundred. No revalue is given, so we'll take B V book value. So after that, last stock. How much stock is given revalue? Twelve thousand. So in this way, we have taken the asset. Sometimes revalue, sometimes book value. When book value is not given, we take the revalue. Now we have to add. Forty thousand, one lakh sixty thousand, eighty thousand, fifteen thousand, five thousand two hundred, and twelve thousand. See the total. How much coming? How much total is coming? Total three lakhs twelve thousand two hundred. This is known as total. A for asset. less liabilities less liabilities taken over so under this we have two liability first is given what is our creditors how much creditors given 45000 book value because revalue is not given after that bp bills payable bills payable how much is given Seven thousand revalue is not given, so total of this forty-five plus seven, fifty-two thousand. We have to minus from total asset. So we have asset three lakh twelve thousand two hundred minus fifty-two thousand. How much coming? Look how much is coming. Three lakh twelve thousand two hundred minus fifty-two. Thousand. So how much coming? Two lakh sixty-three thousand two hundred. This is known as a P C purchase consideration. This is known as P C purchase consideration. Now what happened in this case? They are giving us. हम लोगों कितना आने वाला है P C? Two lakh sixty thousand two hundred. दिस आर टू पार्ट अपने को क्या मिलना है ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड शेयर्स इन टू टेन इंच सो ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड इन टू टेन इंच कितना मिलेगा टू लैक्स क्या मिलेगा इक्विटी शेयर्स इक्विटी शेयर्स एंड बैलेंस वी विल गेट इन कैश सो वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट बैलेंस सो टू लैक्स सिक्सटी थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड माइनस टू लैक्स Sixty thousand two hundred. We will get in cash. So, is के लिए हम लोग क्या entry pass करते हैं? Two purchase consideration due. पैसा आने वाला है कितना? Two lakh sixty thousand two hundred. New firm account debit to relation account. Very good. So, new firm में debit में जाएंगे, लिखेंगे two relation. 
रिलेशन में क्रेडिट में जाएंगे लिखेंगे बाय न्यू फॉर्म टू लैख सिक्सटी थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड टू लैख सिक्सटी थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड अभी ये पैसा मिलने वाला है लेकिन अभी पैसा मिला पैसा कैसे मिला टू लैक्स क्या क्या मिला इक्विटी शेयर ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड इंटू टेन सो इक्विटी शेयर कैपिटल अकाउंट डेबिट बैलेंस क्या मिला कैश सो कैश अकाउंट डेबिट सिक्सटी थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड एंड टू किसने दिया न्यू फॉर्म सो टू न्यू फॉर्म अकाउंट सो हम लोग क्या करते हैं न्यू फॉर्म में क्रेडिट में जाएंगे बाय इक्विटी शेयर्स टू लैख बाय कैश सिक्सटी थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड तो इन दिस वे वी टैली द न्यू फॉर्म अकाउंट सो डेबिट में लिखा होता टोटल फीस टू लैख सिक्सटी थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड बाय क्रेडिट में इक्विटी शेयर्स मिला टू लैख कैश मिला सिक्सटी थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड सो इन दिस वे वी टैली ओके इन दिस वे वी आर प्रिपिंग द परचेज कंसेशन and we are passing the two general entry all the best for your exam